Well, good morning, America. This is Jim Bob coming to you from the Jim Bob's Commentary Channel. It's in, in somewhere in America in a secret location to be disclosed at a different time. But anyhow, I thought today I'd talk to you a little bit about the drones. Uh, the drones uh, uh, started out in the, using the drones over there in Iraqi uh, a while back. And now uh, um, things have exploded, and they got the drones everywhere now. Uh, the Amazon's using the drones, or going to use them, and the UPS is going to use them, and the people are buying them to get to use their own self, and and uh, they, they're just we're out of hand here. The drones is ever everywhere. Everybody's getting them, and uh, I, I'd get me one, but I can't afford them. Uh, I ain't got enough money, but um. Here's the thing. There's this fella. Uh, I see it on the news. Uh, there's a drone flying around his house, and uh, his daughter's was out in the pool, and they're spying on him. And so he went over there and got his shotgun, and he shot that daggum drone right out of the sky. And I, I say, good for him. Only thing is, he got arrested for it, on account of he was not discharging the firearm in the in a public place or something like that. So you know, it is state right these drones can go anywhere they want to. I know they're up there, uh, airplanes is flying around them and uh, I don't know why the airplanes is afraid of them. Drones is little, it seemed to me like uh, airplanes would just crash them drones instead of the other way around, but somehow or another the big old airplanes is afraid of the drones and uh, that's a problem. And so, uh, I, I, it's really a problem if you can't shoot them out of the sky out of your own yard. That's what's bothering me. Now, that's what I'm going to talk about. You see, uh, one time when I was a young fella, and my dad, uh, he rest his soul, he's gone on to heaven now. But my daddy, um, the, we live by the airport. And uh, the Airplanes decided to change their uh, approach pattern to landing, and it come right over the top of our house. And by God, when that one of them planes landed, it rattled the daggum dishes in the cupboard up there. I mean, they come in close, and uh, so Daddy got mad about it, and he wrote him a letter, and he sent in the letter. Look here, he said, when I bought this land, uh, the man told me that I owned it from as far down as I could dig and as far up as I could see. And I don't remember giving y'all no permission to fly over my house. Well, you see, that, that made sense to me. And, uh, and the same thing goes for the drones. If you fly a drone over old Jim Bob's house, you expect to get shot down because uh, I said no fly zone. See, that's what I'm saying. Over Jim Bob's house is a no fly zone. So you come on if you want to, but if I see you out there, you can expect to get shot at. And go put me in jail. I don't care. I mean, uh, uh, I don't have to cook if you put me up in the jail up there. I don't have to make my bed or nothing like that. So uh, that's what I like. Go and lock me up. I don't give a shit. Anyway, uh, the drone thing is getting out of hand, and I thought I'd do commentary on it and give you my views. And uh, you know, one of them terrorists—see, that's another reason you ought to be able to shoot them out of the sky. No, terrorists get a hold of them drones; they're gonna try to blow somebody up with it. And uh, so I think we ought to just shoot them down anytime you see one. Shoot it. That's what I'm saying. All right. So that's my commentary today. Jim Bob's out.